What was around before television? Before a working computer existed? And the movie camera itself? And heavier than air aircraft? The original viral meme? Tray cards? And their eye catching pictures? And information packs descriptions? So it seemed only natural to show a few examples in my short film about looking back and looking forward. Retrofuturism is us looking at them, our ancestors looking at us, or a distorted fairground mirror of us, a mutant mishmash of what came true and what didn't. Both are entertaining in an equal measure since the few elements that do seem to miraculously echo what was to them the future fill us with wonder and awe. Did they have a crystal ball or a time machine? Our explanations becoming wackier than the original predictions themselves in an infinite feedback loop. Perhaps we've underestimated them and we do have lots in common with them after all. Conversely, the failures just look like surreal alternate universes fueling our imagination and curiosity even more. If there is one subgenre that makes us question the function and influence of media itself, it's retrofuturism. How much of the imagery is a reflection of the fears, hopes and desires of the individual in society, and how much is actually shaping and moulding their expectations, pulling the strings like a puppet master, surreptitiously inspiring the visionaries and influencers of tomorrow so that it becomes a self-fulfilling prophecy. Even more relevant today than it was back then perhaps, surely being able to in some way predict the future underpins everything. We wouldn't be here making and watching videos if our universe was so chaotic that life couldn't exist. Now that ordinary people like me and you effectively have the keys to the media, our own personal movie or television studio, or so we think, can we too start a future trend from our bedroom, like the proverbial butterfly flapping its wings in Brazil that triggers a storm thousands of miles away, or is it just a democratic mirage? Are our dreams just drowned out by billions of other people's versions of the future, all frenetically competing and conflicting with each other, reminiscent of the grandfather time-travelling paradox playing itself out in a collective consciousness? Thank you for watching my video, and please feel free to leave a comment and feedback. Now that you see that video, you might want to click on these other cardboard adventures.